Holmes, I have the results of the trial. Listen to this. The judge, in summing up, said... Holmes. Watson, may I be permitted an educated guess? Go on, then. I would expect Woodley to get ten years, Williamson seven years, and Carruthers, in view of the eloquent speech I made on his behalf at the trial, probably six months. That is exactly right. <laughs> well, I have certain advantages, Watson. Largely the fact that I sent out for the early edition. An undoubted advantage. <laughs> also, we have received a present, some wedding cake from Mr. and Mrs. Cyril Morton, together with a letter telling us that Mrs. Morton has inherited a large sum of money from her uncle, Ralph Smith, formerly of South Africa. The happy couple are thoroughly enjoying looking after young Sarah Carruthers, while the father is in custody. Her piano playing is improving, and she wants to take up bicycling. A splendid day all round, wouldn't you say? There is more splendor yet to come. More splendor? What do you mean? Watch carefully. Oh, I remember. The chemical reaction that will solve the mystery concerning the persecution of Mr. John Vincent Harden. Precisely. I've spent the entire week in the Imperial Science Museum, and I think this is the answer. That is the answer, boss. <laughs> oh, the next slide. 